most frustrating thing about this game? Uh, I feel like we never got going. And I feel like we played on our heels the whole game. And uh, we we didn't uh, hit them in the mouth. And we, we wasn't aggressive the whole game. But, you know, that's they're a great team. Hats off to them. They made shots. We came and they built them. And we expected that, but we just wasn't aggressive. And they took a, you know, we got stragged in that time. Is it a situation where you're, you're glad you guys have another game Monday to kind of get this out of your system? Yeah, I mean, I feel like, you know, that's the thing about basketball, that you, you got a quick turnaround and we get to play a team. That, uh, hopefully we can redeem ourselves from, you know, the loss we had at K-State and uh, try to play our heart out, you know, Monday. What's going to be the biggest uh, challenge with, you know, only getting back to Lawrence at <clears throat> two and having a brief window to get ready for them? Just getting rested, uh, getting our legs on us. Uh, Feel like everybody's fatigued, everybody's short on their shots, and not explode. So it just gets getting the proper rest. How are you gonna do that when you got a big game on Monday? But what was the key in that first game that you think you guys are that's most important to get corrected for the second one against K-State? Uh, we just gotta play hard every possession. Everybody don't nobody have no sympathy for you. You just gotta play hard every possession, play as a team, and go out there and compete and play for the name on the front of the jersey. Do you feel like you guys have that urgency? Right oh, now? yeah. We got the urgency. We might seem a little down now, but we had the urgency. It'll be turned up uh, sooner or later. Did you expect it to be better today? Oh, uh, yeah. We, we prepared. We prepared. But we prepared all week. We just, you know, sometimes you, you get a flat tire. You know, we, we had a bad game as a team. It seemed like you guys got to the ball first on the rebounds, but you weren't secure enough with it, and they would snatch it away and, and continue a possession. What does it take to be a strong rebounder? Uh, just securing the ball. I mean, a lot of times, you know, guys get hit on the rebounds. You know, they, they call it on one end and don't call it on the other. But it's just you got to secure it, like you said, with two hands. We get our hand on the ball. We just got to, you know, snag it in and be aware of our surroundings. Are you expecting Ellen Fieldhouse to bring it as much as Bramlage did? Oh, yeah. If not more? Oh, yeah, they definitely going to bring it. We all know that. And we just got to bring out a game and give them what they need and bring the enthusiasm to the game and bring the fight to K-State and not let them bring it to us. I guess what would your message be to anybody that's looking from the outside and counting you guys out right now? Man, trust the process. We really not looking out outside. You know, once we uh, reinvented this team, we was doing it day for day anyway. So we weren't worried about the guys on the outside. We doing it for the guys on the team sure. and for the name on the front. Thank you.